This photo is taken in about 1970. Who knows who this is? Come on, nerds, speak up. It's Ken Thompson and Dennis Ritchie, right? And they're the inventors of Unix, which is an operating system that uh, is in pretty much all of our devices uh, in this room. And they're using a teletype machine, which was, at the time, the best interface for writing software, because what it replaced was punch cards with holes punched into specific positions to record ones and zeros. And each card would be about 80 columns wide, and you treat each card like a line of code, and after you punched enough cards for all the lines of code, you'd have a whole program, and you'd keep it in something like a shoebox, and you could write helpful notes for yourself on the sides of chunks of it to describe what that piece of your program does, like function names. Um, so this photo with the teletype 50 years ago represents the first direct low latency interface between programmers and computers. You could just type into the machine to create software but you still had to create that software line by line, right? Text editors in the day of the teletype were actually line editors. Humans would print out a line of code and then they'd think really, really hard about uh, what change they'd want to make to that line because each round trip with the computer consumed ink and paper. And when we finally got CRT terminals, that cost disappeared, but editors didn't change overnight, right? At first they could display more lines but edits were still made at the line level. They were still a lot like line editors. You couldn't just cursor around in the file